Here's your WNEM-TV5 news update. Good evening, I'm Jamie Sherrod. Here's a look at the top stories we're following tonight. COVID cases remain high in Michigan. The state reported 768 new coronavirus cases and four new deaths. Now, state health officials report more than 96,000 cases and 6,393 total deaths. A surge of positive cases are linked to CMU students returning to campus. The Central Michigan Health Department discovered 38 new cases this weekend. Officials say many of the individuals who tested positive live with several roommates or attended large social gatherings. The department is still investigating the surge. Animals from recent cruelty cases are up for adoption at the Bay County Animal Services and Adoption Center. A number of Chihuahuas and mixed breed Chihuahuas are ready to find their forever homes. Over the next few weeks, the dogs will be spayed and neutered. Each applicant will be reviewed so the dogs can be paired with the best possible match for their needs and personalities. You can fill out an application online or by visiting the shelter. Well, nearly two dozen massive wildfires continue to ravage parts of California. Officials say the high temperatures and ongoing lightning strikes continue to fuel them. The fires have killed six people and incinerated nearly 700 buildings. The blazes have taken nearly a million acres of brush and forest. Containment of the largest wildfires remain low. California is requesting additional support from other states. So far, they have deployed nearly 14,000 firefighters as additional lightning storms are expected to hit. Well, now here's John with a look at your forecast. All right, here's a look at your WNEM TV5 weather update. We will continue with mainly dry skies as we go overnight tonight. A few isolated thunderstorms north of the bay wrapping up early this evening. Temperatures tonight will dip down into the mid 60s. Winds generally light to the southwest at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. It's another hot and humid day as we start off a brand new week into your Monday, upper 80s near 90 as we get into the afternoon. Humidity also going to be increasing throughout the day as well. We'll watch for dew points getting back into the mid and even upper 60s by the time we do reach the afternoon. So it does look like we will have not only the heat, but a very humid air mass in play. And that will give us the chance for a few thunderstorms, especially as we go into the afternoon and evening hours of your Monday. And we'll have isolated chances for most of the week. We'll be watching Tropical Storm Laura, possibly giving us some more moisture to work with by the end of the week into the day on Friday. That'll be our best chance for some showers and thunderstorms and then drying things out and less humidity is expected expected as we get into the weekend. In the first Warren 5 Weather Center, I'm meteorologist John Gross. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24-7 for the latest news, weather and information.